afraid it would need fruit from the land of youth to heal her now. Nothing in this world would do much. What do you think those are? I am delighted to see you two. Two children are just what I wanted. Look here, Uncle Andrew. It really is dinner time. You really must let us out. Must? Well, well, if you really must leave, I suppose you must. But I must give you a present before you. Wouldn't you like a ring, my dear? Holly, don't be a fool. Don't touch that. Start making a noise, your mother will hear it. And you know what a fright might do to her. What have you done to her? You should congratulate me, my dear boy. My experiment has succeeded. The little girl's gone, vanished, right out of the world. Are you going to bring her back? She can get back if someone else will go after her. Wearing a yellow ring himself and taking two green rings. One to bring himself back, and the other to bring her back. Make your choice, adventurous stranger. Strike the bell and divide the danger, or wonder till it drives you mad what would have followed if you had. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Dickory, don't. If you don't ring the bell, then we won't find out. has broken the spell. We've come from another world, by magic. Well then, let us be going. Going where? Why, to your world, of course. <laughs> where is the magician who called me into this world? I will allow you to be my servant. Tomorrow, I conquer the world. I'll go I'll order a cab. We got to get her back to her world. Laugh and fear not. Narnia is established. Yet though the world is not five hours old, and evil has already entered it. Foolish boy, why do you run from me? Do you know what this fruit is? Is your uncle really mad? <laughs>